You talk about citizenship and integrity, and I have to say, I've had the opportunity to dine with you before, and I'm always jealous, uh, envious of your humility. There are so many people in the business world today, we won't name them, uh, who, who like you are household names, but they don't carry themselves in the same way. Why do you think that is, and why do you think you're so different? I don't know that I've always been this way in my life. Uh, I think there's a certain security that comes uh, with success. Uh, and so I, uh, uh, I feel, uh, uh, I, I don't really have a sense that uh, what I've accomplished is, uh, is, is, no, is really worthy of, of, uh, uh, of necessarily uh, being observed. Um, and, and not only that, I'm the type of individual that uh, erases my previous history and achievement uh, year after year, if not more frequently, uh, going forward as though I'm starting all over again. This is uh, the way I get, I think, insights that um, are not uh, affected by uh, or inhibited by my experience and, and the comments, comments of others. And uh, I've always done that, and I'll continue to do it. Uh, even today, at age 82, um, I erase what's occurred the last few months, and I look at uh, issues today with a new eye. And, uh, and this gives me, I think, new insights. Some are discarded through experience, and some, on the other hand, uh, are worthwhile. And um, this is not, by the way, the best outlook in an, within an organization where people like more stability and don't necessarily like the idea of, of your doing a 360 degree turn um, every so often. Yeah. Uh, but that's, that's the thought process and it works extremely well for me. Uh, it really means I observe newness uh, as it's occurring uh, by so not by taking over the other experiences. You sort of open yourself up for this New experiences. Yeah, yeah. It's a, it 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 means uh, not basking in your past success to the point where you're inhibited by what's going on, but that you can see it with fresh eyes. And some people will argue this is not possible in an 82-year-old. They will argue, and I, I have no counter arguments to give, other than I continue to um, uh, deceive myself that this is what happens. That I, I look at things afresh. Um, I, I, if you asked me, am I a problem solver, I would say in my own way I am. And the reason that I'm a problem solver is that I can look at the things afresh and develop a whole different set of ideas, um, that some of which you synthesize with what's going on in your current life, and you progress uh, and have done uh, good things to renew your business.